All right, let's do it. <laughs> that's, that's good. That's all I know. <laughs> yeah, let's do it. All right, Kerry Warner, stage one, Transmania Epic. Had to go out there. It seems like you had some competition today. Yeah, it's a, it's a spicy first day. I, I, uh, I don't remember it being quite as fast as quite as fast as today in years past. So yeah, Caleb Swartz, Carson Beckett, um, Nick Lando. Who else was up there? We got some UVM guys up there. Ethan, yeah, it was, I think. Ethan. Yeah. yeah, that sounds right. Yeah. I didn't do much talking. I was really surprised, like actually, how much talking was happening today, because I felt like we were going pretty fast. And like, well, when you have Gordon up there, Gordon just like he just he just like you're doing like 400 watts, and he's just like, "Hey, pal, how you doing?" <laughs> and uh, I didn't. I haven't ridden with Caleb too much, but he's actually the same way. So then you get those two like together, and you're just like, it's like actually frustrating because you're like at the front, like kind of drilling it, and they're just like back there talking. What are they talking about? Just dumb shit. <laughs> like, Caleb's being a bike nerd. Gordon's just like trying to get to know people, like being a social butterfly. So, yeah. <laughs> all right. So it's I mean, early on in the road sections, you're all together. Where does it start to whittle down out there? Yeah, it didn't happen until much later in the in the day, like the last seven miles, really. Uh, uh, after feed two, we hit some single track and Carson kind of pushed it on some shale trail. Um, and it broke into a group of, of Carson, Caleb, myself, and Gordon uh, into Old Burn, one of the last kind of single tracks. And I jumped in the front for that just because I knew that it's like the first proper rocky section. And then that kind of led into Wildcat, which was like a big kind of rocky climb. So I just wanted to not be in the back, I, I don't know, I didn't know how Carson and Caleb would handle the rocks and stuff. Um, we managed to get away from Gordon and then it was just us three, so uh, yeah, I just kind of led. I, rocks were dry, so uh, I just wanted to be the one picking lines out there. And those guys held their own, so um, yeah, kind of today kind of showed me that one, it's going to be a pretty spicy week in terms of, of fitness, uh, you know, like effort, but also like these guys are very capable on the East Coast rocks, and uh, yeah, it's going to be it's going to be tough. It's going to be more tactical. Um, I'm going to definitely have to choose when when to go. You know, got to pay attention to people's body positions and how people are feeling. So yeah, it's going to be a fun week. What's a, what's a telltale sign with body position? Well, for one, when Caleb's not talking, that probably means he's going pretty hard. <laughs> uh, yeah, and just like watching people kind of towards the end of each stage, like if they're getting sloppy on line choices, stuff like that, if they're letting gaps open. So just little, little, little things that kind of tell you you don't want to be behind that person or that kind of thing. Nice. All right, dude. Great job today. Thanks. Thanks.